The season has started, and the Marlins are rocking their classic teal uniforms. They looked sharp on Friday night, and it should be mentioned the roof was open. This activates Jorge Soler's solar power, increasing his war by three points. He made a hell of a catch in right field, robbing Pete Alonso of extra bases. That's always good. Bottom of that inning, he blasts a homer to pretty much the same spot. That's pretty fun. He must have a deal going with Jersey Mike's because hits the homer to the same zone. He made another really good catch later in the game, so Soler was killing it on both sides of the plate. Conversely, you have Jazz Chisholm. We all love him, but he's definitely been struggling in center field. The easy ones he can catch but he's obviously not very familiar with the position and the tricky ones. And you know, that would make sense because he's never played center field in his entire life. So we're all watching and hoping he can get it together, but it seems the struggles are also hurting him at the plate. He's been racking up the Ks, and you have to wonder if his struggles on defense are related to his offensive problems. But at the end of the day, Luzardo pitched a hell of a game. Super strong start, just two hits, some lovely Ks, two hits. He walks them loaded in the sixth, and they take him out, because that brings up Peter Pancakes, which could mean disaster. He hits it pretty well to center, right for Jazz Chisholm. Can he handle it? Is the game over? Will Luzardo's start be wasted? No, he grabs it. And Luzardo's popping off in the dugout. That's got to be a good feeling. Your teammate had your back. But that was hardly the end for Jazz. He lays it all on the line with this dive, letting Danny Berger snag a double. Unfortunate. Yet, on the next pitch, he gives it another shot and loses the hat, but he does make the catch. He comes up the bottom of that inning, and now that he's made a few decent plays on defense, does his bat heat up? He fouls off the first, and the catcher is like, come on. This guy's on the cover. We're, we're going to need to do a little better than that one. He bounces the next one, and then they come at him with the inside fastball, and Jazz is back. Blammo. Little tough to see, but that's an upper decker. That's up there. He crushed it. Huge bat flip. Good little jog. And you can tell he's just so excited to do that Euro step. First one of the season. Really comforting to see him back on board. They have this fun little celebration in the outfield after they win the game. Seems like a respectful bow of admiration and tender love, perhaps. If I learned anything from this game, you make good plays on defense, you hit a homer right after. So hopefully Jazz can get on track in center field and they'll keep the roof open for God's sake.